In this video, I'm going to show you how to calculate matrices using your Casio FX 991MS calculator. Note, you can only perform calculations up to three rows by three columns. So I'm going to show you two examples. One is a multiplication with two rows and two columns in each. And the second one is the addition of the same thing. First thing we need to do is on your calculator, you need to go into matrix mode. So you're going to select mode, 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 and then you're going to select two. You can see that the matrices is at the top. After that, you need to select the dimensions of your matrices. So what we're going to do is shift and then four and then one, the dimensions. So we're going to start with the first matrix. So we're going to call this first one matrix A. Okay, so this is M times N. So it wants to know what is the dimension. I'm going to hit two, because there's two rows, three columns, and then two columns. So it's two by two. Now it's asking me for the actual value. So it wants A11, one, one. so it wants the first one which is two. So you're going to select two. Good one. Now it's asking for A12. So first row, second column, so it's one. And now it's asking for A21, which is one. Select one. Then it's asking for A22, which is also one. Okay, so that's A. You've entered the information into your first matrix A. So we've called this matrix A. Okay, and now we're going to do matrix B. We're going to go shift again. And then four, right on top of the same matrix. Dimensions again, so you're going to hit one. And then we're working on matrix B, so two. And again, it wants a dimension, so there's two rows and two columns. So hit two by two. So now it's asking for the actual value. So you have A11, one, one, first row, first column. So select two, two rows. And then second one is negative one. So you're going to hit negative one. And then now it's asking for again, so negative one, so the second row, and then the second column, second row is two. Okay, so you now that we put them all in, what you're gonna do is you need to clear all this. So hit clear. Now you're gonna go to shift four. We're going to select three for matrix E. And now we want to select matrix e A. So the first one we call matrix e A, which is one. Then we're going to hit multiply. So we want, here we're trying to multiply it. And then we're going to do it again. Shift four, three for matrix E. And now we want matrix e B. Okay, so it says matrix e A times B. So matrix e A times B. It equals, oops. So just it equals and your answer for that is three. Since I've already stored them in there, I can now do the addition simply by changing my multiplication to addition. So you're gonna go shift four, three for matrices. So again matrix A, hit addition, and then shift four. Three for matrices, select matrix B, and if you add them, it's four. And that's how you do matrices on your Casio FX 991MS.